Uh, I think I like these more than the Red Bulls, do I? I thought I had, oh, I need the stool. When it comes to my husband. That's why I stay in my only woman section. Is this new? Hey battle face, welcome back to another vlog. It's me, Andrea, and I low-key just put this camera down. <laughs> Just so I can start this other random vlog that literally has no like point to it, but here we are. Um, it is Saturday. It is Saturday. It is about three now. It is about three twenty on a Saturday, and I am about to head out. Hold on, let me put this freaking tripod back on here. I'm about to head out. Oh, you know what? I need to text somebody and see what the fuck we doing tonight because what? I feel like I keep low-key trying to make plans with people and they just don't want to hang out with me. Am I, do, do I not look like a fun person to want to hang out with? I feel like I'm pretty damn fun once I put some clothes on and I'm feeling myself a little bit. I like to think I'm fun, but I've been trying to make plans with people and they haven't been wanting to hang out with me. I feel like, you know, you know how kids and men make friends, how they can literally just walk up to another man or how kids can walk up to other kids and they're just like, will you be my friend? And the other person's like, yeah, we're best friends now. Maybe I need to try that approach. Maybe that's what I need to try. Cause I need friends, y'all. I've been sitting in this house for two days straight. I think I left yesterday to get like Taco Bell and I went to stop at the grocery store. But that's about it. In the past two days, I'd be like, dang, I want to go somewhere. I'm sitting here right now. I don't have anything else to do, so I was just editing a video, and I was about to start studying. But then I'm sitting here like, I'm bored. Like, I don't, I don't want to study because I'm bored. I am going to be, what was that? Was that something? I don't know. I am going to be taking um, my Kettering book, though, and I'm also going to take a... Um, highlighter because push comes to shove and i'm just not finding like anything like this entertaining to do because i'm about to leave the house that's the thing I'm, I'm about to leave the house i gotta go to the px to get a gift and then after that i don't know i don't have friends so i don't know and all of the people that i would i feel like everybody's working Ooh, is kiara working i think she did say she picked up a shift see Everybody just doing stuff and so I am going to go out I'm gonna go find friends I'm just kidding if I run into people I run into people but I'm I'm still too shy to be like will you be my friend so I'm not gonna do that but I'm gonna try to make friends I'm trying to see I'm should I bring I'm gonna bring my iPad to, Ooh, actually I think it's dead hold on y'all let me check yeah that thing on 10% Okay, yeah, so I know I wanted to run to um, Ross to see if they have that perfume and stuff for my aunts and my grandmother. Hopefully, like, the freaking lines aren't wrapped around a store like it was yesterday, and hopefully they actually have some good customer service because I'm telling you, I was pissed yesterday. I left a cart full of shit just sitting there because what you're not going to do, you're not going to try to play with me in my face. I just took out this energy drink. Y'all, I think I like these more than the Red Bulls. Do I? Let's 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 not put too much now. Maybe. But these are really good. I definitely like them more than the Celsius. And I have that and then I have some strawberries here. Because what I'm about to do is I'm about to get ready for the gym as well. Do I think I'm gonna go to the gym? I'm not sure. But because I'm gonna be outside and I don't have to work tomorrow and I don't have to study. And I literally don't have anything to do, y'all. This feels so good. I got all this free time. Oh, my God. I got so much stuff to do. Like, not so much stuff to do. I have so much time. I can do so many things is what I was trying to say. So, um, I already have my gym bag in the car. <laughs> Sam is looking at me like I lost my... Sam. What? Y'all, look at her. First of all... She's upset because I won't let her outside. So she has this look on her face. But last time she went out there, I don't know if you can see this, but she have like a little owie here. Then on a, on her ears, it's all like scabbed up right there and right here. 
So I don't know what was going on there. Then she was limping. She had like a little lump on her hand. So no, you can't go outside. And then she ended up having some really bad, disgusting diarrhea that was a little bit bloody. She's since recovered from that. But Sam, Sam, Sam. She knows she's not going outside until we have a vet appointment. So I can make sure that she's fine. So she's gonna stay inside until then. She's on punishment. Anyway, I have not been to the gym in ooh, probably, was that my stomach? Oh my God, that was my stomach. It's a mess I'll be leaving laying around. I'll do this stuff later. Um, I haven't been to the gym in like, almost two months I want to say like it's it's getting pretty pathetic it's, it's getting pretty pathetic at this point and I need to go to the gym so because I do have this free time on my hand I am going to go ahead and pack my bag and what I always take in my bag um I like to take an energy drink I like to take some fruit literally any cup of fruit it could be grapes it could be pineapples it could be cantaloupe I just like to eat some fruit before I get there and then I like to I like to pack my cup. So this is the cup I'm using now. Um, it's this little blender bottle. It's pink. Where did I get this from? Did I get this from Amazon probably? I can't remember where. I, oh wait. I feel like Trey got this from me from somewhere. I can't remember. But it has these cute little compartments. Um, this is one of them. What's the other one? I feel like there was. Am I missing one? Hold on, Okay, so one might be in a car somewhere, I hope. Yeah, it's probably in my gym bag that's in the car. Oh, freak, and I have the stepper stool upstairs. Okay, whatever. All right, I had to run out to the car, but this is my gym bag. Where did I get this from? I feel like I got this from like, Walmart or something like that. Where did I get this from? It's Reebok, so I'm pretty sure I got it from Walmart. Um, who's that? So yeah, what I have inside of here. So I got the little um, bear, the bar cushion thing. I keep some stronger deodorant in there. This is my Dove, but lately I haven't been needing it because the um, Nada finally started working for me. I got some ankle straps, some grip straps, which I want some different ones because I don't I don't really like these. You have to wrap these around and I don't know. It's just like you you wrap them around, you put them on your wrist, you wrap them around, and then you wrap it around the bar and then you kinda you're kinda like holding on to it like that. And I just don't I don't like that. I want the actual um the the loop ones if that makes any sense. So Oh, my air, air pods, my headphones are in here. I wonder if it's charged. Trey bought me these as well, these Beats headphones that I use at the gym. Are they charged? No, since when? Oh wait, they are. Come on. Why is it not doing it? First of all, I know they're charged, because I haven't really used them. I use them a few times at the gym. But when I say these things hold a freaking charge like a champ, I can sit these down for three weeks in a row and, and they're gonna remain fully charged. But why aren't they connecting right now? Come on. There we go. See, look at that, 100% everything. That's insane, y'all, that is crazy. So these are my headphones that Trey had bought me back when I was in um, Texas because I was doing a lot of working out with him. And so my, air, my freaking AirPods will fall out of my ear 
and I kept complaining about it and then I come home one day and those were on the bed with a cute little note because every single time he buy me anything he'll it's a reason behind it he puts a little note on it and I think that is the cutest thing but um yeah but that's crazy because I feel like I've had this bag in my car for literally over a month almost two months I haven't been to the gym haven't used them in two months almost two months a hundred percent everything come on now that's what i'm talking about um here's my other strap here is the other little container part that i was looking for i keep a perfume in there this is this is actually one of my favorite perfumes my idol um my idol perfume by let Cole. it's almost all gone and that is insane because I literally have one slipper in here. I usually have some shower shoes and there's one in here. So now I got to find the other one. I'm not going to need them today anyway because I'm going to come back home to shower if I end up going to the gym. I like to keep a lip gloss and a chapstick just in case because I'm telling y'all my lips be so freaking dry. And yeah, so let me go ahead and stick this stuff back in here. I usually have like a towel in here. I will have some. I keep everything in here. When I'm in the gym and I'm actually doing well and I'm going consistently, I pack my bag pretty well. So put that in there, put that in there, put my deodorant back, perfume back, my um, Alani, Alani, and my um, strawberries in there as well and let's go ahead and prep this now hold on one second the crazy part is i usually have um flavored water i do not have flavored water i actually completely forgot hold on what are you doing i said no come on let's go come in Y'all, right, I let the door, I crack the door so Sam can like sniff the air. Cause she really, she really does like going outside. That's why I let her go outside. Y'all tell me why this girl done found her way out. And so I'm looking, trying to figure out what the hell is walking around on the patio. And it's Sam. Her ass and figured out how to squeeze through the little slot that I left open. But she's outside now, which in all fairness, I did tell her that today would be the last day I let her go outside before um, until she has a vet visit. So I guess she can be outside today, but then a vet visit. Anyway, so as far as my cup goes, um, oh, I usually have flavored water. I forgot to get flavored water, so I'm going to be using this water for my cup. And let's see. Oh, I need the stool and it's upstairs and I don't feel like going to get it. All right, let me just take everything down then. Which one is this? This is what I need. Wait, is this the one? Did I not open this? Wait, no, because this was open. No, wait, what? Oh, okay. I'm about to, y'all, I was about to trip because I have my pre-workout right here. And I'm like, okay, I know I use this. Like, why do I still have this stuff on it? No, I had a sample. So I was using this. Um, I had a bunch of the samples from um, this place. I was using the sample pre-workouts and I was, um, I had opened the creatine. So I was using this. So let me show y'all what I use real quick. So um, I have this One Up Nutrition. That is what I've been using. I have the Venice, the Miami, Venice, the Miami Vice pre-workout. And I really like it. I really like this. This tastes so freaking good, like a freaking pina colada or something like that. It tastes good. I really like that one. And then... I mix, I do a scoop of that, and then I do a scoop of the creatine, which is the guava nectarine flavor. So this one, I really like this one. And then, um, 
So what really started me on this brand is I ended up seeing this protein and I really was never like a supplement protein type of person until Trey. Um, so when I saw this protein, I'm like, oh my gosh, I really want to try this because a lot of the ones that I was running into, I just did not like. Y'all, when I say this one tastes so freaking good, this tastes so good. I haven't been using it the way, because I mean, again, I haven't been in a gym. Mm, 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 mm. I haven't been in the gym, but what I'm wanting to do is I'm going to start doing my mealtime protein again and like after workout protein shakes, like just small ones. Um, the other proteins that I have, I tried this um, isopure, um, this isopure protein, and I think this is the mixed, okay, this is the mixed berry. I thought I got lemonade. I always think I got lemonade. But this is the mixed berry flavor, and I like this one, and I got this one because I was so sick of the vanilla and the ch the chocolate and like just the very heavy, milky tasting proteins. I was kind of over that, so I wanted something a little bit more fruity, and that's why I ended up getting this one, which I actually really like this one too. Now I don't know which one I wanted use after I work out if I decide to work out um, and then I have some collagen and peptides which is the orange mango flavor I haven't used this yet but yeah all of this y'all when I say anything one thing about my husband one thing about my husband is he gonna support me either way it go whatever it takes either way it go he gonna support me because when I say, I'm like, yeah, I want to go to the gym. I really want to get serious. I want to start doing things. I just, I, you know, I want to start, like, taking it serious. Buy me all these things. He bought me a few workout clothes. He bought me some leggings. He bought me a few of the onesies. He bought me all these supplements. He bought me a cup. It's not a game. It's not a game, y'all. And then when I told him that, actually, yes, I think I am going to go ahead and take the TMC. Um, and I'm going to also apply for nursing school. I'm just going to go all in. I'm just going to do it. He buys me my dream stethoscope. Listen, when it comes to my husband, that's all I'm saying. But let me go ahead um, and get this stuff ready. Oh, oh my God, that smells so good. Oh, that smells so good. Come on, open. Why am I weak? I always get crusted up stuff in like the, the tread and so you gotta like bang it on something in order to get it to open up, but. All right, so what I'ma do Who's calling me? I know I have an appointment tomorrow. Hold on. These automotive things take like 30 seconds to start talking. Like anybody else would have hung up the phone by now because why aren't you saying anything? 22. 22 seconds. 26 seconds. 30 seconds. Hello, this is calling to confirm with Andrea that you have an appointment scheduled at 9.45 a.m. on Monday, December 18th. If you need to cancel or reschedule this appointment, please contact the appointment line at 9109. I'm so glad I got that call though because I thought it was at 8 o'clock, not 9.45. Oh, hold on guys, my very temperamental cat for whatever reason. There you got snacks. She didn't even stay out there long. <laughs> she usually, she's usually gone. She probably knows. So, um, I take, actually, this one was two scoops. Two scoops of this one. So that's two scoops of the pre-workout. Put all that stuff back and then I do a nice big scoop of this creatine and that's that one actually let me put this one away first and then I have a bunch of these little free samples that they send to which I actually really like that they do that so ooh, salted caramel what is that I like those. 
Um, and then as far as All right, let me get my life together for a second. And then I like to put the water in the cup already to kind of have it ready. That way, as soon as I pull up in a car, I don't have to go into my bag or anything. Let me just dump my powder in there and shake it up. Y'all got be hype as fuck too. And don't let me have hit that damn albuterol before I go and I'm all shaky and shit. Oh yeah, it's about to be lit. I need some workout friends too. I need some people to go to the gym with. I just need friends. <laughs> Um, so then I like to just put that right on the bottom like that. And then for my post, I said I was going to use the, oh, BCAs, where are they? I was going to use this. So I have this in the guava and nectarine sample. I always use the samples first. Wow, who are they trying to keep out of this? That should not be that hard to open. I just dumped that inside of this other one that I have. Go ahead and put that on the bottom of here. Boom. And make sure that's closed. And we are ready to go. Stick that in the bag. Stick this extra water for my post-workout stuff in the bag. And that is it. That's the stuff that I take to the gym for now anyway. Um, all my stuff is on this side. All Trey's stuff is gonna be on that side. So yeah, we're good to go. Oh, and then I have some more stuff over here actually. Just for the sake of showing y'all, I also have this green and read uh, superfood that I want to start using. I wanna test this out and see what's this about. I was using this bloom, but I won't lie. I just did not like the taste of it. I could not get down with the taste um, because I feel like I mentioned this in past vlogs, but it says berry. So in my mind, I'm expecting like a berry flavor, but it's a very non citrusy, very smooth, like milky flavor to the name. And for some reason that messes with my psyche. I don't understand why. And then this is another one of my favorites, the oat milk protein with, um, the vanilla oat milk protein. So I use those as well. I usually put this in my oatmeal. It's really, really good. And I have these things over here because I usually use them in the morning. So that's that. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my things. So grab my bag. I got my purse. I got my khakis. I think my ID, my card, all that stuff is in the car. And let's go. I'm so glad I already got gas in my car because I do not feel like stopping. And this is the fit. You probably can't even see it because it's like black on black. But this is my outfit. I got on my cloud hex with some leggings I got from Shein. I have this jacket that came from um, Amazon that is so flattering, y'all. I love this jacket because I showed y'all the white one already because it has like, it comes up like this. So it's so flattering. It looks so good. That is such a nice jacket. And I have like just a little tank top crop top underneath here. So that is the outfit. That's what we're working with today. I love that. All right, but that's it. So let me grab my things back in my hands real quick. Oh goodness. All right, Sam, I'll be back, okay? I'll be back. Oh my goodness. Y'all, I started neglecting my car just a little bit. Just a little bit. Not too much. Not as bad as y'all saw it before. But um, there's crumbs and there's a few things that I need to throw out real quick. All my appointment list. <laughs> I need to just get one, like, one appointment list that everything is together so I'm not keeping this on my freaking front seat because I literally keep it on my front seat just to refresh my memory when I um 
forget about appointments and then I got all my freaking debit cards and credit cards just sitting here throw those in there I'm just organizing my back a little bit and while I find my freaking um, shower shoe but now I don't feel like going in the house to get the other one um, that was here. Right, so Somebody asked me about where I got my pillows from as well. Y'all got these from Etsy. Just finished straightening up the car a little bit. Now I just got to do a little bit of vacuuming out. So y'all, I'm telling y'all this thing is a lifesaver. I need to dump it. Let me dump it first. But I have this little portable vacuum that I keep in the car. And this just makes it so much easier for me to keep everything nice and clean. Because even though the suction power could be stronger, it does what I need it to do. It suctions strong enough that I'm able to get the, like, get the trash and stuff off of my seat. And that's all I ask for. So let me go ahead and dump this so I can do that. And then I can finally leave. Gosh, it's so late, huh? Hmm. Hopefully it's still... So yes, that is my little portable vacuum cleaner. And don't mind these ashy spots that you see on my seat, like all of this. Y'all, I spilled an entire large orange juice um, in my seat and like it was just pulled up up here so I had to like hurry up and scrape as much as I could off the um, onto the floor so most of it wouldn't sink in it's dry now it doesn't smell anymore luckily but now I just have like this problem like all that stuff so Trey ended up bringing me the little our what is it our um, carpet cleaner little hand thing and yeah, I'm gonna see what I can do to this seat to get it looking back like this one. So yeah. Mm -hmm. But that is it. We are about to be off to the PX. I just left the PX and they did not have the freaking perfume that I need. Like how is that even a thing? Any other time, any other time I come to this PX, they have it in excess there's so many like the small ones the big ones all of a sudden the moment i need to come here to get it it's gone but i was asking the lady about it and she said um they should be getting the truck in um sundays so tomorrow they should be getting some truck in to hopefully some is on the truck so i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to come back tomorrow afternoon so sunday afternoon just to see if they end up putting anything out um yeah that sucks like that's the one thing that i wanted to come and get that and then the cream so i'm just gonna grab everything tomorrow because i'm i'm just hoping they have it and if they don't have it i'm gonna look for something that's kind of close to that so what i'm about to do now i'm kind of hungry but i really since i did pack this gym bag i'm about to go ahead and try to get like an hour or so in at the gym and on top of that it is 4 36. y'all know what that mean y'all know what that mean for the gym everybody and their mother and their grandmother about to be in there so it's not like i'm really about to lift i guess i'm just gonna go to the all-woman section and do a little sum sum there because 
I don't see myself getting anything done. I don't see myself getting anything else done. So that that sucked. And while I'm out there, I think um I'm gonna stop at the mall and get me some food from the mall. Cause I just love that freaking mall Thai food. Like the rice and the chicken. I just love it so much. So that's what I'm gonna do. Hmm. Hmm. Too, I really feel like I haven't been to the gym in forever and forever you know what let me oh this is so super bright is that okay I was looking a little bright so since we're about to go try to be a gym girly today that means it's time to mix this we go ahead and break my shit down and mix it up real quick um let me not mix these up Okay, that's definitely the one I need. All right, I'm gonna put that one in there. I don't wanna be 20 something. Y'all, I love Rod Wave. Like, I love him. I lo Like, I love him. I feel like every single time, it's like, it's either I'm going through something and I listen to his music and it motivates me to get me out of it or I'm going through something and I'm just so shocked and so numb to it that I can't react to it so I just have to listen to his shit to help me to help me feel these emotions to help me get through it yeah I just mm, mm, mm. I love him <sighs> I hate that when they get caught up in the treads just bang it against something a little bit It's not working. It's not. Hold on. <clears throat> Gotta bang it the right way. Just right. <laughs> you gotta bang it just right. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. That's. That smells so good. I'm just hoping it tastes good because y'all I y'all know me. I don't like drinking regular flavored water, but this this is gonna transform it, right? It's gonna do exactly what I need it to do. Look at the views. Look at the dust. Here we go. I don't wanna be Oh shit, wrong cup, wrong top. I don't wanna be a twenty something. It's standing mine on me. I'm supposed to be checking something. <sighs> here y'all i'm so sick of these fucking people on instagram like i shouldn't have like i made a i made a post um it went viral it has like over five million views on it or whatever and is it still at five million yeah it's over five million and i just don't understand why it's so popular because one it was a fucking joke right and two um it's like I don't know like if y'all want to see what I'm talking about go look at it it's the one where I'm in my um, burgundy wine colored scrubs and I'm cleaning off the pole because it came from a patient's room it's the end of the day I ended up wiping the pole down and as I'm wiping it down the tr the medical trend like that all the doctors and dentists and nurses and stuff were doing like with the um the stripper music basically um to participate in the trend and all of a sudden I am bashed I'm the reason um, people are on their deathbed I'm the reason there's no room in for any patients in the emergency room I'm the reason nurses don't get paid enough I'm the reason everything my kids are doomed I'm never gonna find a man to love me and God hates me that's what this post turned into and so every time i open my fucking instagram it's it's more i mean obviously there's positive comments and stuff under there too but it's just irritating like how, am i able without like muting or discon or taking out the comments because i don't want to turn off the comments like you're gonna you're one thing you're not gonna do one thing no one will ever do is bully me off the internet y'all not gonna have me crying and bully me up off the internet it's not gonna happen so I don't want to turn off the comments. Um, I don't want to do any of that. I, I'm just leaving it alone. It's just irritating 
Um, <laughs> I'm just irritated that I just keep getting notifications. Like, do posts ever die? Like, do they ever die down? It's so weird. Anywho. I was checking something else. Know. It hit right there. That tastes so good. And I like pina coladas and getting lost in the rain. Oh man, that's actually really good. Okay, I don't regret it. And now that I'm tasting it with regular water, maybe I should stop using the flavored water now that I think about it. This is really good. It's never tastes like that with the flavor of water. I like that. I'm gonna start using the regular. Just regular. Um, where's my inhaler? So y'all, what I do, I sip on this while I go to the gym, but before I even take off, because I know I have to let my, take my albuterol and you know, it takes about 10, 20 minutes for it to actually like take effect. Um, I take four pumps of that before I even get anywhere, before I'm about to run, before I get to the gym, any of that. And it makes me really jittery. Just so you guys know, albuterol makes you jittery and it's meant to make you jittery, okay? I have some guy under my comments on Instagram because again, y'all, since I've gained a little bit more of a following, I only have like over 40 something thousand, but, but, apparently that's enough to garner hate but that's besides the point the point is i had some guy under there talking about because i had posted something about how i'm jittery and he goes oh that's because you're taking it wrong you're putting it too far in your mouth and you're letting it hit the back of your throat when you let it hit the back of your throat that's what makes it jittery actually you wouldn't have jitters if it hits the back of your throat and i'm sitting there trying to explain to him how to take a fucking mdi and he want to argue with me i'm like sir you do know this is my job you do know I give these type of treatments on a daily, multiple times a day. You do, like, this is what I do. So why am I arguing with somebody in my comment section who don't know? Y'all, I'm so sick of people. Breathe in deep, hold for 10, eight to 10 seconds, let it out. That's how you take an MDI. Anyway, um, so now that I took that, I'm about to be all jittery. I'm about to turn on my music and get hype as fuck while I'm going to the gym, what? Let me stop, let me stop, I'm just feeling. I'm in a good mood, I'm outside. I'm outside the house and there's nothing to do. I don't have any responsibilities right now. I'm just here, living in a moment. So yeah, let me go ahead and get on this road. Let's get to the gym, that way I can get some food after. And I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna be watching later. I think I found an idea from TikTok or Instagram or one of those, but I'll see y'all when we get to the gym. Soften up the mess, drop it in the water, let the daughter find an image with the rest. She'll be learning how to breathe. Spinning through identity, reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie. You understand me. Walk her down the valley. Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet. Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach. Like the angels do. And you gon' make it through now. Tell about the healer Greater is the one within and call him as the leader Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky And I'ma wait up on the giver He'll deliver like a dealer to take her higher Higher Fly out the valley and the fire Take her Show her every door and how the windows let the sun in Copy out the key and tell her this is for becoming Even in the fever, baby, cry and get to running And tell her that you better get your bootstraps up You're with the army Ready when the truth act up, nothing can harm me 
Yelling from the roof, I touch, put up a guard and count to ten. Lion's den, speaking with a higher pen. Can't be touched by fire, then. Fast forward to the grown things now. I'm working on them soul things now. Forgiving all your old ways. But it's harder on the cold day. Cold day. Never been a product of a flawless environment. Never acted like I'm higher than you, 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 you. And I still pray. Dear God, won't you send me a break? Cause I, I need to get away, yeah. Dear God, won't you send me a break? Cause I, I need to get away, yeah. Cause I would rather be, rather be running away. I would rather be, rather be running. Dear God, won't you send me a break? Yo, <clears throat> first of all, that song, Sapiosexual, I don't know what kind of demon time that song be having me on, but listen, my mind, it does something to my mind. Mm. I love that song. Um, it had me on one up in here. Who the fuck do I think I am? For some strange reason, one, I be throbbing listening to that song. Okay, let me stop. Um, and two, I be feeling like I'm that bitch. I'm her when I'm listening to that song for some reason. Anyway, I just finished up in the gym. I wasn't quite done. I was in there for about an hour. And I wasn't quite done. I was enjoying myself until I started... Okay, so the gym that I go to, it has a women's only section. So nine times out of 10, when I come, I'm usually in there. For the majority of my time at the gym, I'm usually in the only in the women's only section because it pretty much has everything in there you need to work out. Except some of, oh shit, there he is. Oh shit. Oh God. Oh God, he's looking over here. Mm, let me act like I'm on my phone. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh God, mm. y'all, he's I'm on my phone. La 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 la. On my phone. I should have turned off the. I should have turned off the. I should have turned off the um, the light. Shit. Oh God. waved listen I wasn't done with my workout the reason I left is because of this dude just decided to walk up like I'm usually in the only woman section and I come out for certain things like ab work because they don't have those machines in there and so when I came out I was doing ab for a little bit and this guy decides to mosey his way over trying to talk to me and so it just got so like I had both my earphones in and it got so irritating I had to just you want attention so bad what so I took one out and he's like Oh yeah, you did you getting a good workout in? I was. And then um he's like, Oh, I see that ring on your finger. Don't tell me you married. I am. That must be nice. I said it is. It is. So I put it back in and I'm continuing to work out, but he's standing like directly over me because I'm on the ab machine where you're kind of like slanted. So my head is down and my legs are up. So he's standing like over me, like right here. So I had to sit back up and I'm like yes and he's like oh no i'm just trying to get like you i said consistency just consistency you want to have a conversation y'all he started trying to really get into like my life and trying to get to know me i can tell i just wiped the damn machine down and left <laughs> so i guess he was walking out like not too far behind me and he was in a car literally parked directly in front of me but that that's why i stay in my only woman section anyway I'm about to run to the mall real quick and grab some food and then take my ass home so I can chill just a little bit. Today was a good day. Today was a good day. But yeah, I'm gonna see y'all when I get home because my camera's about to die. I just left um, Starbucks and a PX. I got my Starbies. I got a everything bagel with some cream cheese and I got my, oh, why is this open? That could have been so bad. Jeez, but I got my usual. I got my chai tea latte on ice with light ice. Um, eight pumps of the chai, three pumps of vanilla, three pumps of the brown sugar, and extra matcha cold foam on top. My absolute favorite. And then I went to, um, I was able to find the perfume that I was looking for at 
PX, y'all. But I found this as well at the PX. Can y'all see that? So this is, hold on, is that gonna focus? That. So this is the um, Brazilian Crush, but this one is the Amber, wait, Black Amber Plum in Vanilla Woods, Prunior Ambre Boise Vanillas. I don't know what that says. I don't know what that even means. All I saw was Vanilla Woods and I'm like, I'm like this. And it's so crazy because y'all remember my um, Seven Virtues? seven virtues um vanilla woods this smells just like it i cannot believe that how like is this new is this new and i didn't know about this because i sprayed it when when i was in there i sprayed it on my hand this i can't wait to get home so i can compare the two but this is seeming like the perfect dupe for that perfume this was 30 two dollars the my perfume is usually around 180 and that is my all time all time favorite perfume in the absolute world that's my that's my signature scent this smells just like it it smells just like it and it's 32 dollars i'm gonna still buy my perfume but now it's gonna last a little bit longer because i got this to put as a base this is mm, 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 mm. I'm excited but um, yeah I'm just in the car just chilling I got the heat on I'm about to probably sit here let me back up I'm probably about to sit here for like the next let me get comfortable for like the next hour or two should I get gas now I don't need gas right now the gas station is literally right in front of me anyway so I'm good um, I'm all wet walking in the rain but I'm about to sit here for like the next two hours listen to an hour worth of Kettering audio after that probably you know watch some vlogs watch some crew 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 crimes crew crimes that's cool crazy true crimes <laughs> and just chill like this is what I usually do y'all I love being in my car I love being in my car that's why I be so upset when it's not clean because then I don't want to be in here it got it smelling like old food and stuff like that but yeah, let me go ahead and get a jump on this studying and I'm gonna see y'all later. So tell me why I, um, it's 15.35 and I fell asleep in this car about three hours ago now. Um, it's still raining like crazy. I'm pretty sure you can hear it. Like, look at this. still raining like crazy i'm still outside of starbucks by the way i'm still on base what's crazy is i kind of knew i wasn't like knowing how i woke up this morning i really shouldn't have tried to put effort into anything today because this is what usually happens i end up sleeping all day all day no lie which sleeping in a car is fine that's actually pretty natural for me i love sleeping in my car i love my car naps so much i literally just be laying back like this i get one of my pillows from back here tuck it in my neck and i'll be knocked out just like this got my legs all up and everything my legs be up on my steering wheel sometimes like this like I just I'm, I'm small so I got enough room to do whatever I need to up in this beach and this is another reason why I like to keep my car clean and why I hate when it's not clean because then I can't do things like this <sighs> I wanted to upgrade my car because this would be so nice if I had a moonroof but like I said I gotta graduate and finally reach that final goal before I even consider consider upgrading because um, I have a 3% on this car 
thanks to Trey, shout out to my baby because of the SCRA is different in Louisiana. So I was able to um, bring it down on this car as well, even though I got it while I was in. That's besides the point. Uh, so now what I'm about to do, cause I also just uploaded a video on YouTube. So hopefully you guys already saw that one, but I'm about to sit here and finally turn on this Kettering audio. Let's study a little bit. I woke up and gulped down the rest of the Starbucks drink. Like I said, I can't drink something this big in one go, so everything is working out so perfectly. Like, even though I felt like it felt gloomy, like, I feel good. I feel okay. Like, this is, this is perfect. I feel like if I was in the house, I would be in tears in a corner somewhere or just literally doing whatever I can to stay asleep because my mind would have been running, running, running like crazy. But I, it's something about being in a car outside the house when nobody is at home. So I feel like this is the perfect opportunity for me to ask you guys, are you subscribed yet? Have you subscribed to my channel? Did you like this video yet? Did you like the last video yet? Did you? If you didn't, can you please? Anyway, I'm about to go ahead and end this vlog right here. This is probably a shorter vlog, but that's fine. It's I, There's more to come, but I'm gonna go ahead and close this one out. I'm about to start studying, but some of my study materials. I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Bye.